Good day. The state television company of Western Armenia presents all the most important events of these days. Today's broadcast on May 9, a Zoom conference will be held on a topic, the general situation of Western Armenia. On May 3, 1920, the Argentina government recognized the independence of Western Armenia. Chavosholo spoke about the possibility of creating a commission to clarify the Armenian-Turkish border. Interview with the historian Ashot Harutunyan. There is a risk of losing St. Pergich Hospital which is operating in Kastadnapol as an Armenian structure. An international conference on the problem of monuments of Artsakh will be held in Vienna. Musho Charantir, the story of a giant manuscript. Dear compatriots, we invite you to take part in a seventh session on the online conference on general situation of Western Armenia, which will be held on May 9th. The speaker of the conference is the President of Western Armenia, Chairman of the National Council of Western Armenia, Armena Gabramian. The conference will be held in Armenian. The conference will start on May 9th at 9 p.m. Yerevan time. To receive an invitation to participate, register using the following link on our official website. Western Armenia, Turkish Armenia, received its first recognition as a state after the genocide of Armenians on December 29, 1917 by Russia. On May 15, 1990, after the formation of the government after the chairmanship of Poros Nubar, the Supreme Council of the Allied Powers to de facto recognized the entire Republic of Armenia. However, many people probably do not know that on May 3, 1920, Argentina under the chairmanship of Ipello Irigoyan recognized as the Republic of Armenia as a free and independent state. In the common history of Argentina and Armenia, May is the month that united the two free states forever thanks to the leadership of Armenian community of Argentina. Read the full material on our official website. Turkish Foreign Minister Mevlu Çavuşoğlu touched upon the third meeting of special representatives to be held within the framework of Armenia-Turkey dialogue process. According to Çavuşoğlu, the special representatives at a third meeting in Vienna will also discuss various steps that can be taken in the upcoming process. There was an agreement on the issue of clarifying the border. How will this be done? For example, a joint commission will be created. They have decided to establish a joint commission with Azerbaijan. The Turkish Foreign Foreign Minister said, this may be one of the results of the restoration of diplomatic relations without fair conditions. On Western Armenia TV, historian Ashot Arutunyan spoke about the general expectations of the population who settled in Armenia and other countries from the territories occupied by Azerbaijan after the 44-day Artsakh War. He noted that only after moving to Armenia, the government of Western Armenia took up the protection of its rights. In accordance with this, Mr. Harutsunan advised the government of Republic of Artsakh to sit down at the negotiating table with the government of Western Armenia. The historian presented in detail the main problems of concern of residents, emphasizing the importance of obtaining refugee status and building a separate settlement that will preserve the special flavor of the city of Shushi. Kastadnapol as an Armenian structure, Armenians of Kastadnapol are concerned about the loss of Armenian hospital St. Pergij functioning in Istanbul. In 2013, the Turkish authorities established the current regulations for holding elections to the foundation of national minorities. No new regulations were adopted in the following years. Bagrat Estukyan, editor of the chief in Armenian weekly August, said, at that time the elections were suspended in the Armenian hospital St. Pergij, which has the state of a foundation. It has not yet been possible to prepare a new charter. Now there are rumors that there may be a new charter, but still we will not be able to hold an election for the hospital executive board. This may be an attempt to attract our biggest institution. We are talking about a 188-year-old institution that a community considers as a national hospital. It also had a department for the care of the elderly. An international scientific conference on the problem of monuments of Artsakh will be held in Vienna. Mother C. of Holy Hjmiadzin informs about this. From May 13 to May 14, the countries of Vienna and Salzburg will host Culture in Conflicts, South Caucasus Today Conference. The focus is on the problem of the preserving the Armenian heritage in the territories occupied by Azerbaijan after the 44-day Artsakh War. Mushot Charantir was complied at the end of the 12th century by Ordo Vastvatsatur in the city of Babert in Western Armenia. In 1205, the Charantir was taken to the monastery of St. Arakelots in Mush. 
becoming one of the main shrines of the monastery. It has been stored there for 810 years until 1915. In addition to the massacre of the Armenian people and the destruction of Armenian communities and Armenian churches, Turkish tribes also destroyed thousands of manuscripts stored there. Thanks to the dedication of the Armenian patriots, a large number of manuscripts were saved from destruction. One of them is a giant Meshot Tarantir, weighing 28 kilograms. In the 13th and 14th centuries, when the writing and militarization flourished in High Armenia, the most famous center was the Elder Monastery of Yerzenka, where these largest Armenian manuscripts was written and flourished. It had 660 sheets, each of which had made one of Oak's leader. Now there are 601 sheets in Matenadaran on Yerevan, the other 17 are stored in Venice, one in Vienna. Now musical part Armenian folk song Georgi Minasyan dar derestvi sarerin The full version of this video is available on Western Armenia's YouTube channel. This was all for today. Goodbye.